Hey, I'm here uh, with Jake of Project 321. Uh, a few months ago, I visited him at his Fresno facility where they actually build and make stuff, not only for bikes, but for for these uh, very fancy sports cars. So he knows what he's doing when it comes to metal. But he has some exciting hubs uh, to show us. Uh, Jake, take it away. Yep, so we're here at uh, Sea Otter introducing our new uh, driver. Um, if you're familiar with Project 321, you're probably uh, familiar with uh, our relationship with Industry 9 and the and the the uh, using their driver in our hubs. Um, <clears throat> recently, we have developed our own driver. Um, <clears throat> uh, we made some changes and some well, some innovations that we uh, we're pretty proud of. Uh, first thing is we use magnets uh, to actuate the pawls into the drivering. Um, so uh, the way we aligned those magnets uh, allowed us to do a couple things, uh, but um, first allow, allowed us to uh, uh, lower the drag significantly, like 70% compared to what we were using previously. But what I'm most excited about <clears throat> is it, it allowed us to control the sound of the driver. So we had a lot of customers uh, requesting uh, a quieter driver and you know asking, is there a way to quiet this down? Uh, and with, with the previous drivers we used, there wasn't. So <clears throat> with this new driver, we were able to uh, create two sound options, and I, I can illustrate that here. Um, so this is, this is our loud driver, and this is our quiet driver. Uh, both systems uh, have 216 points of engagement. They're both magnetically actuated, uh, and our quiet driver has up to 70% less drag. Um, so uh, that's what we're out here showing, and uh, we have our full mountain lineup, so everything from lefties, uh, to single speed boost, all the standard configurations with uh, all the variations of hole, hole counts and those kind of things. So um, out here showing it off.